Hi, I'm Ron from UnitedTaps.com, and this is lesson three in our mini lesson series covering steps and heels. And for this lesson, we're going to put them together and do a step heel. We'll also talk about uh, the rhythm and technique and moving and all kinds of fun stuff. So first, let's start with breaking down what is a step heel. By continuing to watch this video, you are agreeing to relieve United Taps and its staff of any liability for injuries or damages caused by watching or attempting any of the movements presented in this video. If you do not agree to this, please discontinue watching this video now. Thank you. So first, let's start with breaking down what is a step heel. It's exactly what you think it is. It's a step and then you drop a heel. A step and then a heel. Remember, step has weight on it. And then for that heel, we do want to push down, right? We want some downward pressure. And then we're going to release all the pressure at once. So I have pressure, release, pressure, release. Pressure, release, pressure, release. These are staff heels, congratulations. You know how to do it, this is beautiful. Excellent. Let's go a little faster. One, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and keep that pressure up, and eight, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and. Now I just wanna go into a little more detail about that pressure. What you don't wanna do after you step is just roll through gently, right? Because then you can't hear my heels barely, right? You wanna put some pressure, release it. Pressure, release it. Pressure, release it. Now, we're not just doing that pressure, not just so you can heal the he hear the heel, that is important, but if we don't learn to put that pressure in there, when we add that step heel to other moves like a shuffle, shuffle, step, heel, if we haven't learned to put pressure, that heel's gonna start coming down too soon, especially when we go faster. Listen to this. Ooh, that sounds terrible. But if I have pressure in my heels, listen to this. So this adding pressure, it's not just making sure the heel's loud now, it's ensuring that when we add the step heel to other things, or even if we just go faster with step heels, that the heel will not be too early. All right, so it's accomplishing two tasks at the same time. So every time you're put, doing that step, you're putting some pressure, downward pressure. My leg is pushing down, and then I release all at once. We always oh, we want that pressure in there. Now it's true, when I go faster, I'll have a little less pressure, because I don't have time to push that hard. But when we're going slow, this is a good time to build up the leg strength so that pressure is naturally there when we go faster. All right? So it's a good habit to get into. Put that pressure in there, and you got it. One, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and. Now for today, that's the only rhythm we're gonna do. We're gonna keep it really simple because I just want you to get the basic mechanics down, but we will do some dynamics. We're gonna do two soft step heels and then two loud step heels and then two soft and two loud and we're gonna keep that going. Let's give it a shot. Five, six, seven, eight. One and two and now loud. Three and four and five and six and seven. step heels are. You know how to count them. One and two and. You know how to do them soft and you can do them loud as well and go back and forth. Now let's move them around because that's a lot of fun. So I'm just going to start doing step heels. Just follow along. When I move to the right, you move to the right. When I move to the left, you move to the left. Here we go. Six. Ready. Go. One and two. And I'm putting that pressure in there. Four and. Ready? We're going to move to the right. The right, here we go. Yes, you got it. It's not too hard at all. <laughs> Pretty easy. Now I'm going to go to the left and I'll step out with my left foot and then my right foot. 
come in. Join it. You got it. Keep that pressure up in the heel. And we're going for a nice straight rhythm right now. One and two and three and good. Now I'm going to go backwards. Good. Keep the pressure up in that heel. Enjoy yourself. That's why we're here, right? Having some fun. Now forwards. Yeah, pretty easy. Just keep that rhythm nice and even. We're going to rotate. There we go. Keeping that pressure into the heel. So we got a nice loud sound. And that ensures it's not early. When we go faster, we're going to rotate the other way. You got it. These are step heels. You're a pro now. Look at you. That's beautiful. All right. Awesome. So now you know what step heels are. You know how to count them. You know technique. We want to put some pressure on that heel and then release it. You can do volume levels, soft and loud. You can move it right, left, back, front, circle, and circle the other way. That's pretty good in one lesson. Let's put some music on and do all of that. We're going to have a good time. All right, I'll slow down a little bit. Are you ready, my friends? Let's do this. Five, six, ready, go. Had a great time. You know how to do them. You know how to count them. Uh, you can do soft and loud. You know technique. Put some pressure into that heels. You can travel right, left, front, back, rotating or to the right and rotating the left. You got these down. Now in our next lesson, we're going to be take all the stuff we put together. We got our steps and all the rhythm patterns, and we have our heels and those rhythm patterns, and then we have step heels and all the movement and the dynamics. We're going to take all of that and put it together in a combination. I'm excited for you to do it. I think you're going to have a great time. All right. Hey, at UnitedTaps.com, as much as I love doing these short videos, even a mini lesson series, nothing can compare to having a full lesson series, right? A full series. Our beginner lesson series is 12. We got 12 lessons. It's 12 hours, right? 12 hours long. We teach you the steps. We talk about technique. We practice them slow and work our speed up. We put them together in combinations. Uh, we talk about the technique. We really cover all your bases and we give you a chance to really get comfortable with the material. And just like in this mini series, we build on things, right? After you learn steps and you learn heels, you put those together, right? So, we'll, you know, we'll be teaching you brushes and we'll be teaching you spanks, and then we'll put those together into something called a shuffle. So we build things up logically and in a way that you can feel good about what you've learned and then apply what you've learned in the following lesson. So that's our full lesson series. It's going to take you all the way through the beginning level. We cover, we cover 37 different steps. 37 different steps. That's a lot. Plus, we're putting all of those into combinations. Uh, you're going to have a great time with that. We even have packages that, that take that, those huge lesson series and we'll add in choreography, a full piece of choreography. You'll learn a, a, a full dance. They're about two and a half minutes long where you have to, you have to memorize the whole thing. 
Plus, you've got to coordinate your arm. We do arm and head movements in those, so you've got to coordinate those. Um, some of our uh, routines have music, so you've got to coordinate the timing with the music. It, 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 and you've got to have the stamina to get all the way through. It will get you in really good shape. Uh, so that's part of our, our, our beginner package. We have uh, the choreography. We have a tap dance dictionary, which uh, shows you videos of individual steps. So if you're like, oh man, I just don't remember what a step heel is. You can go to our list and click on the button and boom, there's a video of a step heel. Plus you get a set of notes that tell you exactly what a step heel is as well. So if you need that quick reference, like you don't want to go back looking through, okay, well, what lesson did we learn step heel? Was that lesson three? And and, and what part of lessons? You don't have to do that with the dictionary. You can just be going, step heel. Oh, there's a video. Now I remember. That's right. Exactly. That's what, how we do the step heel. Uh, so we've got that as part of it. Uh, we've got a workout video that'll get you in shape. It's, look, if you're going to uh, exercise, why not tap dance? Because A, it's more fun than normal exercise. And B, it improves your tap skills. It's like a huge win-win. So we also have a workout in, in our uh, package deal. We have a lot of great things. You should check that out. That's all available at unitedtaps.com. Thank you so much for tapping with me. I had a great time. I hope you had a great time too. I, of course, am Rob Howe from unitedtaps.com, making you happier and healthier through tap dance.